think obviously just people have different directions in life and maybe you're working hard and working all day, you don't feel like going into a gym or going anywhere, you can just loads of exercise you can do at home, you can do your own personal stuff. I mean, you can do stuff without weights and stuff like that, so you just look up ideas online, you'd be able to get some, uh, some small exercises to get you started. Obviously, if people have uh, the amenities to do it at home themselves, they might as well do it there. But um, a lot of the gyms have a lot of uh, cheap enough offers at the minute as well, so you can obviously get out there. And there's always lots of classes on and stuff that you can do. I think I've done quite a few of myself, a bit of spinning and stuff, which can be fun. And not only fun, you can make, meet, meet, meet new people as well, and then maybe do some other stuff with them as well. So, yeah, I obviously think it's important if you're going out and exercising, you can come home and, and order a Chinese takeaway. So uh, I think um, what I try to do is I try to plan my, my day around what I'm going to eat and what I'm going to be doing training wise. So if I'm training in the evening, I'll make sure to prepare my meal for when I come home because I know what's like when you come home from training or come home from the gym. The last thing you want to do is go cooking. So I think the best thing to do is to maybe try to prepare a meal before you go out to, to the gym or to whatever you're going to do and then come back and have it ready in there. You don't, you're not going to be tempted then to get a, 